This is a this is a two bedroom, two bath, Gold Coast condo listed for twenty twenty nine fifty. Scott, what are we looking at here? Yeah, I showed this one the other day, and it just it blew the doors off of me. I was um, just amazingly surprised. It's actually it's a top floor unit on the Gold Coast. Um, it was actually a two bedroom, two bath, and a studio that were combined, completely gutted, rearranged, reconfigured. And the end result was like no detail was left unthought thought of down to central AC, which is not normal uh, along the coastline. Plus you have two, two parking stalls, so two bedroom, two bath, fit, over 1,500 square feet right on the ocean. The pocket sliders open up um, and you're, all you hear is the ocean. Palm trees are swaying right in front of your face. You see all the way down the coastline to the Waianae Mountain uh, mountain range, but 1,520 square feet. And it's, uh, the, the maintenance fee is only $1,345 a month, which is really low for uh, you know a condo of this size and, and in that location. Wow. Uh, I mean, that is killer, man. I mean, just the view alone. I mean, that's an insane. It's not even a view. It's like you're, over, it's like you're on top of the ocean, at least the way the picture looks like here. Yeah, it's it. I mean, all that sound comes right up to you. You actually have multiple surf spots right out there, so you can just watch the people. The sailboats go by on the Friday nights when they they go down to the buoy a little further down, then turn around and come back. And it's, I I would sit at that table, and I don't think I would probably move for for hours on end. I I didn't want to leave. We were actually in this unit for over an hour, just taking it all in. There's side windows down the side. So you, you get these different perspectives from even the master bedroom, which is actually down the side of the building. You can lay in bed and look down the coastline, a uh, really unique unit, great airflow, but it has everything from central air conditioning to you name it. Phenomenal you know, unit. You know, Scott, a uh, uh, Gold Coast, uh, uh, folks may know what Gold Coast is. Gold Coast, if I'm not mistaken, is that area. It's just outside of Waikiki. It's in, the, in sort of like the, the shadow of Diamond. So you'll, you you have like Diamond Head right behind you. Uh, you're facing the ocean. You have Waikiki just to your right, right? Is that is that the Gold Coast area? Yeah, the amazing thing for Gold Coast. So once you get out of Waikiki, you obviously have Kapiolani Park, right? And you have the zoo, the, the aquarium, the natatorium. Kaimana Beach on around almost to the base of Diamond Head is that Gold Coast section. So out your back door is a 300 acre park in Diamond Head and out your front or vice versa, however you want to do it, is this, you know, just ocean oasis, this playground right in your backyard. So it, it's, it's phenomenal. You walk out the back door, you yeah. can go for a jog. Yeah, you know, that's right. Amazing. But yet you're an Uber ride into Waikiki, two minute Uber ride to get to whatever you want in the hustle and bustle. Yeah, two minute Uber. And I, I didn't think about that. You've got a Kapilani Park. You're right. It's right behind yeah. you. A 300, a beautiful 300 acre park is literally your backyard. Mm -hmm. So you've got this killer park as your backyard. The ocean is your front yard. That's why it's called the Gold Coast, right? That's why, yeah. that's why they call it the Gold Coast. All right. Speaking of Gold Coast, Dylan, man, I think 